welcome back everybody so today I'm going to try and do I think it's called a traveling kiss pour um, so I'm gonna do it in a back black background and then we will see what happens all right let's get started all right so I went ahead and I did the back black background black and I thinned up my paints a little bit. Hopefully they're thin enough. And well, let's get started. Hopefully I have enough paint for these colors, but we'll see. It's not a real big canvas, so I shouldn't need too much paint. Should have had these in the scene a little more, but all right, let's see. Um, let's start this way. Quite what I expected, but it's my first one, so can't have everything turn out wonderful. Well, I was kind of hoping it would turn out to be like a feather, but. I don't know. I don't think so. It's not turning out the way I want it to. something else with it. Let's do something else. Let's do some maneuvering. Mm -hmm.
not sure what I did wrong with the kiss, but maybe my paints are too thick. I don't know, but it was my first time and I don't care. Just wanted to try it. Probably not something I'm going to be doing a lot of anyway, but all in all, I think this is turning out to be very pretty. All right, I'm going to give it a spin. Get this stuff out of the way. Wow, that's very pretty. I like the negative space. Well, what do you think? I don't know what to call it. It's certainly not a double kiss pour, that's for sure. But if I do it again, if I do a double kiss pour again, I don't know. I like the way this turned out, so. All right, let's do a flyover. I like how the red, gold, or whatever you, these are metallic colors, but I like how this area is by itself, and then there's the gold, yellow area over here by itself, with the blues mixed in. I'm all in all happy with the way it turned out. Alright, I'm going to try it again. I'm going to try to do the the double kiss pour. I think I know what I did wrong, so I'm going to try it again. So be patient and let's see how it goes. All right, so I think I know what I did wrong, so I'm going to try it again. Um, in a second, I see a piece of hair got in my paint. So I think I need to have the black behind the colors and not side to side. So let's try it again. I know you can't really see it until I'm done, but I decided to use the neon colors up. Still doesn't look like a feather. Well, practice, practice, practice. That's what I always say. I have been doing painting here now for, well, I don't know, almost a year. I just stumbled upon it. I was doing the resin stuff for a while and then I kept seeing the videos for the acrylic painting and all that. So. I just kind of fell in love with this instead. I was also doing like 3D modeling. I don't know if you guys ever heard of, you know, like animated characters and stuff like that. I used a lot of ZBrush. I don't know if you ever heard of that company. But yeah, maybe I'll post some of my characters that I modeled in my video. Maybe. We'll see. A lot of bubbles in that one. <clears throat> Still didn't look like a feather though. I don't know what's up with that. Guess I'm gonna do some maneuvering. Let's see. Let's see. 
let's pull it this way. It kind of looks like a wet feather maybe. <gasps> I don't know. I'll have to pull some of these in. Maybe give it a the feather look myself. I know I got the, the the paints in the right order, like the black in front of the colors, so I just think I don't think my paints are thin enough. I'm that's what I'm guessing. I don't know. Maybe you can tell me what I'm doing wrong. I do not know. I've never done this. Well, besides the second time right now, but Sorry for all the sniffling and stuff. I've kind of been sick. It just sniffling. I mean, I took me all, like the last couple of months I've been sick with this cold. Finally got over it. My husband got sick and I made a mistake out of drinking out of his water bottle and voila, here I am all sick again. So, now I gotta fight that off. Called in to work today. They knew I was gonna call in because I went home a day, half a day early the day before, so. But, all right, I'm going to do something. Where is my toothpick? Yes, I'm going to spin it, so I never leave my paintings unspun. I don't know, I just think the results are better if I spin them. All right, here goes nothing. If it gets ruined, it gets ruined. That's just the name of the game. I gotta level out that paint and we'll see, it. I guess we'll see what it looks like when I'm done. Maybe I'll have to do some swirlies. Hmm. All right, well, I'm gonna do it again because it got big and fat, so I'm going to probably have to do some swirlies, but let's just do some swirlies now. How about that? Mm -hmm. It's no longer a feather, so... So I'm having 
a karaoke birthday party for myself. Um, it's on a Saturday, May 18th, which I doubt you guys, any of you guys live in the area, but if you do, it is on my Facebook page. I posted it. If you guys want to come and have some fun and some drinks and party, party, party. Okay, not party, 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 just party, party. Not party, party, party. I'm too old for party, party, party. This didn't turn out again the way I was thinking it was going to. It still turned out pretty cool. All kinds of bubblies. This is the best part though. Always fun popping the bubbles. Let's just get let's go. spin. Lovely, lovely. Looking lovely. Why is there no paint on this one? Hmm? Hmm? What kind of game are you playing there? Yes, the B stands for Billy. Something to set it up on. Of course, it ain't gonna make a difference, I don't think. Alright, just do it like that. I don't really like getting paint all over the back. But, I'm a little messy. Messy, messy. Well, there is another double kiss failure. Another double kiss failure. But all in all, it turned out beautifully. I'm going to take you in for a close-up. Isn't she lovely? I decided to use up my neon colors so I can mix new ones. Because I used up the the metallic ones I used earlier in the video. So, if you like what you see, please leave a comment and share your thoughts, and we'll see you in the next one. Happy pouring.